So many books. We should be careful. This place could be booby-trapped. Let's just start looking for the enchanting book. Oh, books. A brief history of cubism. Crafting for noobs, revised. A collector's guide to precious gems. None of these are enchanting books. He looks sullen. What's up hey, with you? Is having any luck? No. I just I've been thinking about other stuff actually. Stuff such as you know, Gabriel, Yasalots, people getting wither sickness and amnesia. <sighs> Don't get me wrong. I'm glad I came with you. I just I'm just scared for everyone. For them, for us, for everybody, really. Don't worry so much, Lucas. There's no point, not when you can't do anything to help them. I know, I know. We just have to focus on what's in front of us. Namely, a zillion books. I guess being an angry loner leaves you a lot of time to read. <laughs> Tell me about it. How to train your slime, the various uses of mushroom stew, potionology volume 24? Are any of them the enchanting book? I don't think so. I seriously doubt there is a zillion books in this place. I feel like that's being slightly hyperbolic. Come on. I was just wanted to make sure if there was anything back there. I can talk to you. Olivia, any luck? Not really. Ivor has too many books, and there's too few of us looking. How did we end up all split up like this? I feel like we're spreading ourselves too thin. I miss how What do you want from me? That first night we all spent together, that was kind of fun. Almost. Look, we might be spread thin, but we're all still a team. That's how teams work. Hey, you almost said teamwork. See, we're still funny. We can still get things done. I guess being split up just means we can be in more places at once, right? Kind of like the wither storm. Let's just forget that metaphor. Yeah. How I learned to stop worrying and love mining. The unabridged redstone encyclopedia. Zombies and pigs and intimate memoir. What's the light that's in his face? These seem to be enchanting books either. Where's that coming from? Oh, maybe it's that. Find anything yet? Huh, in this mess? Uh, it's as though Ivor learned nothing from my lectures on organizational methodology. If only he hadn't gotten lost in that confounded swamp. He could just tell us where the book is. Coming here was his idea. He should be here for it. We don't need Ivor. We can find this book on our own. Ha! <laughs> in this mess? Are you mad? There's neither rhyme nor reason to how these books are stored. Finding anything here is impossible. Tedious, maybe. That's impossible? not true. No way. Fine, I will continue this monotonous search. But I reserve my right to grumble about it. It's a deal. I mean, we can find anything. Like, I, like okay, that right there. You see that blue book right there? That's a thing. See? So... Quit your bitching. Maybe we won't find the right thing, but we will probably find a thing. Ruben, what are you doing? <coughs> yeah, well, you're gonna get yourself cooked. I've told you before, stay away from lava. I guess he wants to be bacon. 20,000 blocks under the sea. Learn to succeed by thinking inside the box? I think I'm in the wrong part of the house. Hey, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. Too bad I don't have one. Yeah, no lever, no functioning circuit. Well, shit, we might as well give up. Uh. 
the cyborg character. I'm recalling that he knew something about potions. Could one of these stop the wither monsters? I'm remembering correctly, am I not? That's what started this whole mess, actually. A potion. Then perhaps a potion can end it. His potions just aren't strong enough. Oh, I see. Potion of blindness. Potion of dullness. Potion of nausea. None of these will help me. No, yeah, we can make the Wither Storm puke. It's possible, I, I guess. Be all right, or is this just who I am now? Always struggling to remember what I was. Of course you'll be okay. You're Gabriel the Warrior. Thank you, Jesse. Your confidence in me is stronger than any potion. Except perhaps a potion of confidence. I wonder if he has one of those. Am I just remembering things incorrectly, or... Is the pink eye thing, like, new? I don't think he had those before. I, I feel like I would have noticed. Makes sense that Ivor would have a crafting table. Well, what's inside the chest? Is it Wood a lever? Planks. Those will be useful. Maybe we could use that to make a lever. First, I'll need some sticks. Well, I have some... well, sort of have some sticks. Do I need more okay, than one? Sticks. Okay, nope. Just incorrectly using a plural term. Okay, so we have that. Oh, we already had... Oh, okay. Never mind. We do have plural. There Yay! Go. Good old-fashioned lever. It was made for it, which it was. Let's see what this sucker does. Oh, maybe Reuben was trying to tell us something. A secret passageway. Why would you build a secret passage in a house nobody ever visits? More like, why wouldn't you? Secret passageways are cool. Good point. What the? Uh oh. Are you guys okay? We're fine, but the lever isn't working anymore. Stay there! We'll head down and see what we can find! Whoa! What is all this? Ha! Huh. Incredible! He's gathered them all in one place! Gathered what, exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone! Stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there? Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. Maybe use these this? Cast tiers? They're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool, rare item. We might need it to unlock that door. Mm, very well. Just be careful with it. Careful. See? Am I crazy, or is this a sea lantern? Ah, the very same one the Order built all those years ago. We were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. Sea lantern, huh? Sorry, is this the actual Ender Dragon egg? 
Uh, alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind. <laughs> it's like, yeah, that's mine now. Fuck all your sacrifices. So why does Ivor have the treasures of the Order of the Stone? Did he steal them? No, 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 no. We, we let him keep them when we split up. You let him keep your treasures? Frankly, Jesse, it's a long story. I guess one that you're not going to tell me. Actually, hold up. Let's Why let's keep prodding. Ivor have the treasures of the no. of the stone. Did Shit. Steal them? No, 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 no. We we let him keep them when we split up. Yeah, you yeah, let yeah. Him okay. Keep your treasures? Okay. Frankly, yeah, this Jesse, is something that kind of bugs me. Story. This is one minor thing that kind of bugs me. That wasn't too bad. But it does sort of bug me about Telltale games where it's like if you accidentally find yourself in a dialogue um, exchange for a second time, you can't go back. Or, I mean, you can't skip it, you know? And it is kind of annoying. These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Eligard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Prismarine is such a cool word. Prismarine. Just seems like it would be such an easy thing to do. To just add in the option and ability to skip dialogue. So where does packed ice come from? Well, we brought it back from the Ice plane Spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that... We knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Ooh, cold and slippery. Oh. Aha, a hopper. Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? And I, I'm, I'm gonna check it out, but I'm assuming that putting them in the right order opens this door. Locked. Yeah. Yeah, I figured as much. Can't go that way. Yeah, I didn't think so. Alright. Well, I'm not sure what the right order it's like a is. Regular hopper. It's hooked up to a bunch of redstone circuitry. Man, Ivor sure does love his puzzles. Huh. Five slots. Okay. I have no idea what order it's got to be in. And is there, like, any indication? Hmm. Maybe it was, like, the the placement in which I picked them up. Or not, w not in which I picked them up, but, like, the closest to it's, like... Maybe number Ender one. Dragon egg. So cool. Let's try it here. Um. Fast tears. Let's try them here. This egg was the last thing they got as a group. Soren said the order got these gas. Oh, okay. There we are. A sea lantern. In you go. Soren said this lantern was crafted from prismarine crystals. Hmm. Okay, so this definitely goes after the. After this, that's for sure. Into the hopper. The order used these crystals to make the sea lantern. Yeah. Got it. Yes! You solved it. But how in the world did you know what order to put them in? There were 120 possible combinations. Everything I needed was in your stories. Nice work, Jesse. You know, I often give Ivor a hard time, but for all his complaining, his time with the Order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. By the stars, the Ender Dragon, with replica Ender Crystals and all. Wow, I always wondered what it looked like. Hmm, no way out. 
Well, I mean, you don't know. How do you know that door's locked? Have you checked? I don't think so. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, you know, we might as well just go around pressing buttons in this, you know, secluded area that we have no idea what's involved in. Hey, you. Let's talk. Ruben, do you know what to do here? Uh, well, it was worth a shot. It was worth a shot to ask the pig if he knows what to do? Okay. I think secretly all of these things are happening inside of this man's head, and that he really is just psychotic. Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the Ender Dragon. Despite his anger, Ivor never stopped being fond of us. <laughs> he was a big part of our team, after all. I'm missing something here, Soren. And I have a feeling the key might be locked in that head of yours. I have a key locked in my head? What I'm saying is, I think you need to tell me about the Ender Dragon battle. Oh! Huh. If only you'd been there. It was a fight for the ages. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle ever. But even so, the Ender Dragon was stronger than even I had imagined. I realized that it was drawing strength from the Ender Crystals, and that the crystals had to be destroyed. I hit the first with a perfectly placed arrow. The second I destroyed by launching myself on the shotgun of Magnus' TNT. Using only my strength and my wiles, I steered the foul beast toward the third crystal. I flew the dragon directly toward the final crystal. Only then did Gabriel deliver his famous final blow. We became heroes, and eventually, legends. The greatest the world has ever known. Soren, you are so full of it. Why would you say that? For starters, because you're afraid of flying. Well, oh, okay, but on barges, not dragons. And besides, you made it sound like you were the only one who mattered. I was the leader. Believe you me. Whatever. I wonder if that story will help me solve this puzzle. So Sora uh. rode the dragon, huh? I was thinking arrow, like, if we're doing it in order, it would be arrow first, then the TNT. Let's take a look at this. God damn it. Come on. Like banner about TNT. All right, the sword would be last. So I guess this is Eligard's. And then Gabriel. Uh -huh. There's another door? Um, wait, so that one's locked? God damn it. Okay, so I can't seem to look at it. Oh, okay, maybe this. Hey, Ruben, give me a boost, will ya? <laughs> there we go. Alright. Don't want to fall. Though it's physically impossible, so I should be fine. Aha! Maybe it did all happen like Soren said. Bravo! You did it! There's the book. That's creepy looking. Wait, aren't those the Ender Crystals? Like the real ones? No, it, it can't be. Not here. Not after all this time! But those things were destroyed in your big, heroic battle with the Ender Dragon, right? 
right, Soren? He kept them. The fool actually kept them. He looked me in the eye and swore he was going to dispose of them. Soren, you said destroying these crystals was the key to defeating the Ender Dragon. You did kill the Ender Dragon, right? Jesse, this isn't... This isn't what it looks like. Our story. Uh, the story. It's, it's mostly true. I swear, I swear it. Whatever you're thinking, I promise I can explain. So what really happened, Soren, if you didn't destroy the Ender Crystals? I, I can't. We swore never to speak of it. I think it's time to start talking. Uh, I'm afraid I haven't been honest with you, Jesse. We did defeat the Ender Dragon, but it wasn't exactly like I said. No shit. How not exactly? We got rid of it, but we didn't kill it, per se. In fact, we didn't even fight it. We didn't even try. So what did you do to it? We didn't do anything. We used that damned command block. You used the command block to defeat the Ender Dragon? afraid so. I knew your story didn't add up. Understand. When I found that blasted block, we were nobodies. But with its help, we became stronger. Faster. We could do so much more. The others had no idea what I was doing. Yet the more I used it, the more we came to depend on it. I knew it was only so long before someone would find out. So, I concocted a plan. I would use the command block to blink the Ender Dragon out of existence. Securing our status as legends, forever. We told the world we defeated a dragon. And the rest is history. Why would you do that? You, you lied, even to your closest friends. All I can say is, I was a fool. So you finally admit it. Swarren, how could you? I will. How long have you guys been standing there? Long enough that they heard the whole thing. So we're liars. All of us. Yeah. I think you are. You didn't think you could keep it secret forever, did you, Soren? The truth hurts, doesn't it? But Ivor... Why? Is this why you left the Order? Because Soren lied? Because. They all did. Soren, Gabriel. Magnus, Eligard, they agreed to keep this a secret. How conniving of us. And you, you agreed to stay quiet too, in exchange for all of our treasures. <gasps> I've technically never told anybody. Jesse discovered the truth on his own. So this whole thing, this wither you unleashed has all been to teach the Order a lesson? To teach the world a lesson. To show you who the Order really are. Liars, cowards. And now, they know. Yes. I suppose they do. And how is that any better? You reveal their lies at the expense of the world itself? Look, my wither plan obviously backfired. You think? I didn't know we'd end up with three of those things tearing the world apart. For a moment, I nearly forgot. Well, they are. And while we sit around talking about your dysfunctional order of liars, those things are still out there, wrecking the world. Jesse's right. Destroying the command block is all that matters anymore. How ironic that the best thing the command block gave us was the very means to destroy it. Spare us the poetry. It's not your strong suit. I've had this book for years. Never thought I'd actually have to use it. So the enchanting book, what do we do with it? You craft a weapon.
Then put it on an anvil. Follow me. I'll show you. Ivor? I'm sorry. About everything. Yes, well, it doesn't matter. Oh god. I need the cake though. I didn't get get the cake yet. Alright, they know, shit. <laughs> <laughs> 